So just like any other self-respecting person who has a thousand things to do, um, that probably doesn't entail a YouTube video, I thought I would do a video to show you what is in my bag. This year, one of my New Year's resolutions was to wear a backpack because I think it's about time I start valuing my back health. So I bought this and I carry it around everywhere. So I'm going to show you the things that I carry around daily. So most of the time I have my MacBook on me just because I'm a uni student. And if I'm not at uni, I'll either be at work or leeching Wi-Fi off local cafes. So I have that. Second is my headphones. So just standard beats boots so I got these for my birthday this year because when I exercise the buds were like coming out of my ear holes so I thought it was time to like step up in the headphone game so I also have this jacket in my bag but I think it's cheating because I bought it today But I'm just about to go out and I'm going to wear this because it's a little bit chilly in Brisbane. And by chilly, I mean it's like 26 degrees with minor winds. Um, but yeah, I just picked this up at my local op shop for $12, which kind of evens out the fact that I just bought a $150 Adidas velvet tracksuit top. So, I don't know, it's about balance. I have these um, coffee bags that my in-laws bought back from japan i've been taking these to work they're really cool you like sit them in a cup and then you pour hot water over them and then it filters out and they're actually surprisingly really good in case you were wondering it also makes my bag smell like delicious coffee at all times these these are my favorite glasses They're just Karen Walker glasses. Probably one of my most prized possessions, to be honest. This is probably the first purchase that I like splurged on and I was like, you know what? Treat yourself. So I did. My diary. It's very small. In here I just what is that? Yeah know if I can be a YouTuber if I don't check my face beforehand. So yeah, I just put in my assignments and my shifts for work in this little nifty thing. I hate carrying around like chunky diaries so I also bought this like mid-February when they were all on special. This is my wallet as well. I used to um, just carry around my like key card and license in the back of my phone but I bought this like six months ago um, and it's because it's really small and tiny and it also matches one of my fossil handbags that I have. I bought it at DFO and it was like $18 but I feel fancy because it's fossil. But yeah, just basics. Just the basics. Just the most important things that you could ever have in your wallet. no cash what else yeah I have this in my bag because I was really lazy yesterday for work and I didn't have anything to take and I had two minutes to get to the bus stop so I threw this in my bag and at the time thought it would be a really good idea but I ended up just having like two spoonfuls of it in an afternoon tea break and I ate it with a fork I don't know I bought some Easter eggs because it's just been Easter and I've this is the second stray that I found at the bottom of my bag and it is truly life-giving. I feel like I could eat it now or I could save it for a time when I'm in desperate need. I'm just gonna bub that back in. Also I have so much like rubbish <laughs> from all the eggs that I ate over Easter. Panadol. Bulk pens.
Leider. Tad luck. Fork that I ate said peanut butter with. Check your eyeballs. Not a pen. So that's the main section. And in this section, I just have my Lush lip balm, which I love. My friend bought this for me for Christmas, and I really love it. Go card. Hair ties. I'm at a time in my life where I have like bulk hair ties because I just bought a new packet so I sort of like splurge on them because I always feel like there's like a good six months of my life where I like have one hair tie and I just found these which is a little bit depressing but 40 pence from my recent trip to the UK what else it's pretty much it I just have like notes I always like have notes on me rather than just a note taker. The last thing I have is this stuff, Easier by doTERRA. So it sort of works as like, it's an essential oil. I recently got sort of like half scammed but half interested in essential oils. And this stuff has been really good for like clearing airways and stuff. It has eucalyptus and peppermint oil, tea tree oil, lemon oil. It's just like a big concoction and you just put like a little bit in your palm and then rub your hands and do that, which makes you feel a little bit psychotic when you're on the bus, but whatever. Anything helps. That's all that's in my bag. Does this make me a YouTuber now? Am I a YouTuber? Also, shout out to the double jewelry for these really cute <laughs> earrings that I got today. Thank you, Jackie. You're a queen. Thank you for watching my first video my greasy hair. I look like the um, guy out of Charlie's Angels. <laughs> the bad guy. Forever. Okay, bye!